On our Grow With Care Facebook page, a lot of you have been commenting on the increase in red fox sightings around the area. And for some of you, this has been a great thing. Uh, Teresa Wubler says, we have foxes by our cabin. My dog actually got along with them. They each had their own territory. And when they came upon each other, uh, they would just look at each other and go about their business. And Patricia writes, keeping a fox in your gardens reduces rodent populations that graze on shrubs, dug up bulbs and eat tulips, etc. I love foxes. Uh, but not all of you are keen on the fox families beginning to reappear. A lot of you raise poultry and foxes can be a nuisance. So we went to the Wildlife Rehabilitation Center in Roseville to ask what you can do. You can definitely uh, protect uh, like your a porch or a shed or something where they can get underneath and, and make a den. So people now, this time of year, really should be checking to make sure that there aren't any spots where a fox can go in and, and den underneath there and cover it up with like hardware cloth or something like that. It's terrific for your lettuce patch, yeah, because they're going to, they're going to keep the rabbit population down. The peak of fox kit season is in April and May, so love them or hate them, we still have a few months to go.